So as we kind of look back over the course of the last year, really the journey began as far as understanding what I had right here at Little Chiropractic. And uh, Matt Nanny and, and his wife Kathleen moved here uh, from the north, I think Ohio. I can't remember when or where, but um, <coughs> they moved here and my wife Donna had started going to him because her yoga teacher, Jessica, had told her about him. And so Donna was like, you need to go see this guy. He's really good. And so, um, so I did. And I, you know, as I've shared, I was having pain in my ribs and my back and I, I didn't really know what was going on or even how it was gonna change, honestly. And so I went and saw Matt and he, he checked me out. He did like a full, he did a full x-ray on everything, full body x-ray. And then, um, and so he saw a small, just a something, a discrepancy in my ribs. And he sent it to a radiologist and the radiologist suggested that I get a CT scan. And so that's how I found out was Matt. And I've said this before, you know, he kind of plays it off, but I had no direction whatsoever at that point in time until he gave me that direction. <coughs> Excuse me. So when you think about how everything works, for me, it's always um, a divine plan. It's like God is always working and how he orchestrates that a family would move here from Ohio, wherever they moved from, and get here. And then my wife would meet him and, and start to go to him and then suggest I go to him. You know, and I, I just think, as I think about the lessons that I'm learning and that are confirmed in my life, is you never know. You never know how God positions somebody somewhere to make an impact in your life. And so maybe you're in a position in your life where you're thinking, I don't know what to do. I don't know where to go. I just believe that, that there's always a path of some sort. People will listen and will look. You know, I could have told Don, I don't wanna go see him, but I trusted her. And because I trusted her, it led me to Matt, and I was able to trust him. And the result was we finally found out what was going on. Even though I waited a little too long to get the CT scan, I think he told me the first week of July I should get it done. And, and I ended up getting it done July 26th, which was a year ago yesterday when I'm making this video. But, um, you know, I'm just really thankful for Matt. I'm thankful that obviously, you know, there's all kinds of things and all kinds of reasons that he moved here to Forney for his family and for whatever future and for his business. But one of the reasons was so that I could meet him and he could do that x-ray and he could send my results to the radiologist and he would make that call and say, hey, look, I think you need a CT scan just to make sure. And because of that, we were able to find out what was going on because at that point, to that point, none of my doctors had really done anything to help me, but he did and uh, I'm super thankful. So, you know, for the rest of my life, I'll always think about Matt and how God used him in that way in my life. So anyway, all right, we'll talk to you later.